guys, it's just Rick here, and we're gonna be jumping into God's Calling Hell Mode yet again. You're probably wondering, oh my god, Rick, you're, you're gonna do this video again? I made this video, it's probably one of the second videos I did for GC, or for uh, for the Guardian when I started doing PvE, and I was like really excited, because I was like, hey, I can do GC Hell now. Well, we're gonna do another one, we're gonna show our progression, and I wanna show my gear real quick. I have almost full Rentis gear, except the chest piece. I was able to even get the leggings, even though you can't craft them yet. I crafted every other piece, though. Uh, this one actually uh, was given by a friend of mine. Um, still got the Xenos, still got the shield. Actually, the only reason I'm using that shield, and I do have the new Rentis shield. Uh, where is that at? There it is. Looks awesome. Only reason I'm not using it though is because I put the earth element so it could do more damage in Encelot, although they're very resistant to earth element here, so I'm going to go switch back to my water weapons. Everything else is the same though, as far as gear goes. Now you're going to see I have a... Uh, it's not going to be a clear indication. I was not going to be able to show off the Rentis Bulwark just yet, just because of the fact that, again, you would not see the damage increase very much because of the fact that earth element is... Uh, it'll be very weak in this continent but aside from that guys I am fucking really just beasting on everything in here and you're probably wondering like I started this video saying you're probably wondering why the hell am I doing this continent and it's a very simple reason actually it's kind of a blessing I didn't have time this week to do this earlier I would have but if you guys didn't know the actual something really cool about how they changed GC Hell is that now it drops skill books 100% of the time now sadly the skill books are only level 50 which is comparable to this continent and actually uh, that may be a problem for some people you're like oh I don't need any 50 skill books of course yeah I, I realize that 50 skill books are by and large useless they don't even have like any action animation changes uh, that's not the reason though and I don't know I I linked this earlier I don't know if you guys can see that this is a air stinger perfect book that I was able to get by doing this dungeon and you're wondering oh that's all 57 book well I what I'm doing is I'm farming skill books guaranteed chance at it dropping once I clear this dungeon um, it's always gonna be a rare level 50 and it may be a perfect level 50 and trust me I've gotten already two perfects from here and I've only done this maybe like 15 times so um, I got pretty lucky good thing about perfects is that they are very great catalysts for generating generating more perfects so, basically what I'm doing, I kind of had a lag spike there, basically what I'm doing right now is using the combined system, putting in one perfect and five rares, and then rolling that, usually have a really high chance of getting another perfect out of it. It could be level 50 again, but it could also be level 57 like it was earlier. So, um, whatever level the perfect is, it's good for generating other perfects. So, you got a perfect air stinger book probably for the first book I've been able to use that hasn't been completely useless and uh, level 57 as well so I think this is a really good system if you don't have any perfects available yet um, there's also I mean um, you're, you're just gonna have to try to get one and the best way to do it is just combining rares again so if you combine six rares you can have a chance of getting a perfect as well so not as high a chance as a rare and five uh, perfect and five rares but if you combine six rares, of course you have a chance as well. And uh, that's what I've been doing, guys. So I'm just farming a whole bunch of rares, hoping to get the perfect. If I can kill this guy before he goes over there. Yeah, that should be good. Die. Oh, shit. This guy's not that hard, but if I can kill him before, even right now, if I can kill him. Yeah, okay, good. So I don't have to actually fight the guy if he can kill him. So that's what I've been doing, guys. I've been getting perfect or... A few rares every run and maybe a chance at a perfect and that's what I'm kind of hoping for so I can com combine for better skill books it's gonna be completely random but you know perfect skill books were very very difficult to get before and I'd say this is a much more consistent method than it was farming dimensional farms in fact I'd say even just getting rares is really a big deal right now and something I suggest doing if you don't have the skill books for your class already um, the dim boss farm is a uh, pretty significant was a pretty significant part of my gameplay a long time ago and I spent so long in there and now this is a system that's actually beneficial for me because it's uh, it's a guaranteed rare and it's you know it's not a matter of me just fucking farming the same dungeon and hoping to get a rare out of it like the dimensional farm I'm gonna get a rare 
and it's just a matter of combining them afterwards that's going to be the thing now the hardest thing believe it or not isn't actually getting these skill books like i said it's 100 percent turns out i have done this so much already that i've already used up all of my artisan crystals so uh that's just kind of kind of the drawback is that it's going to cost a lot of artisan crystals and right now because of the combined system they're costing a lot in gold so um, you don't have a lot of time. I wish I could have told you guys about this sooner because I feel like when they release a new 63, level 63 skill books, this is going to be much harder. They're just going to add new skill books into the system, combined system as well, and meaning you're just going to have lower chances overall to get the perfect book that you want. And for the most cases, I've already looked at all of the skill book effects. For the most part, the new skill book set effects are garbage and they took them out of this update. That's surprising. Uh, but in the previous update, we got to see what the skill book set effects were, and they were bad. They were, like, by and large, worse than what they were before. No thought put into them. Basically the same for all classes. I'm not really going to go into that. Um, I guess that's kind of just speculation right now. But from what I saw, the skill book effects were bad. And it, the level 63 books are just going to make things worse for classes like me, who have a really good set effect right now. And, um... If you add more books into the system, obviously it's going to be harder for me to get the skill book effect that I want. So, sorry, that's a lot of skill book talking and not a lot of evidence backing it up. I guess you're just going to have to believe me on that. But for now, I want to make sure that I get books for for this uh, classes that I want, especially because I know the set effect right now is so good for Guardian. I'm trying to hope for it to get any kind of perfect skill book for the Guardian that'd be helping me out don't really need any stars but here you go guys I finally clear the stage and you guys can see how brainless it is for my guardian right now it used to be kind of difficult I'd have to look at my HP maybe recover my HP a little bit yeah that's that's not the case anymore <laughs> I literally just fucking destroy everything without even thinking about it I mean I just did this whole video right now trying to explain this right now and uh, it was that easy but the the rare book is at the chest at the very end and it's a perfect what did I tell you guys so <laughs> Pretty high chance for a perfect as well, guys, and that's my third one in only like 15 runs or so. So, using that, I can show you guys how many books I've been acquiring so far. Just, well, two now. I've been putting them in storage. I'm having a really awesome run right now, and just getting some good use out of these GC Hells that I have. I mean, I have more than freaking almost 10,000 of these fucking stones. I gotta use them. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hope this video has helped you, and I hope you abuse the system as much as you can before they add the new skill books and fuck everything over. So, I'll catch you guys later.